for me, um, I've always been interested in medicine, I've always been interested in healthcare, um, but I'm also interested in computers. So the field I'm in now is a place where I get to combine both interests at the same time. Typically my day is divided uh, between uh, working with people who develop computer systems to support researchers as well as working with programmers and scientists who work directly on my research projects. Uh, those research projects involve things like uh, developing new tools to find genetic associations in medical records, designing new computer systems that are easier to use, uh, developing algorithms to find new matches between genes and diseases. I've been in IT for over 20 years and I've been involved with genetics over the last six to seven years. I'm currently going back to University of Wisconsin-Madison and I've been picking up epidemiology and decision support and more information technology and that's something that I'd really like to look into because I believe that the future is in what we're doing now with personalized medicine. Well, when you're dealing with genetic studies, especially you know now that we're getting the human genome mapped, we're talking about lots and lots of data. We can't, um, people in the informatics or IT area they're going to be the ones that will be able to take that data and make meaningful information or actionable knowledge out of that data. So our contribution is identifying ways to understand how, what the relationships are. Once we find the relationships, how do we translate that into clinical practice so that the patient ultimately benefits? So these are just a few of the career options within the field of genetics. As medicine and computers continue to advance, the field of genetics will continue to expand, and you can be a part of it. For more information about the field of genetics, or career options, consider job shadowing, or ask your teacher to help you find a mentor. Also, don't forget to check the back page of the booklet that goes along with this video for a number of great websites and other suggestions on how to prepare for a career in genetics.